this is the key. It's a puzzle box that I designed and uploaded to Thingiverse earlier this year. It's been downloaded like 2,500 times and I've gotten a huge amount of feedback on these puzzle boxes. And based on that feedback, I've created this. This is the key remix. That's right, I've remixed the puzzle box. The solve is just about the same, but I've taken all of your feedback and considerations into account, and uh, we've made this much better than ever. The key is fatter and less likely to break. The freedom lock itself, the pivot movement, is much, much thicker and will not break. And you can see inside the puzzle box a few of the mechanisms versus before where the, the hearts on the front kind of misled the, the solver. I've also added rubber bands, which you might just barely be able to make out inside there, so the springs no longer wear out. This is the original The Key. It's been uh, one of my favorite puzzle boxes ever. This is The Key Remixed. It's based on the feedback from hundreds of people that have sent me ideas and messages, and we have created a much, much better thing. Now, the puzzle box still requires no uh, fancy printing methods. You don't need brims. You don't use supports. I have been playing around with my, with my layers to get the colors to look cool. I will show you how I do that in a different video. Straight away, we can see that the mechanism to launch the key and the old puzzle box is a little bit worn out and the mechanism to launch the key in the new puzzle box well that works just fine the spring in the new one is much better but we also have a rubber band that is a rubber band supporting the h1 spring key launch mechanism and that rubber band is never going to wear out that is one of these dental rubber bands they're extremely cheap. Uh, on Amazon, a pack of 100 is like six bucks. Uh, I will have links in the description. This is what I'm using now, and I use it for both the 100% and the 150% size boxes. We also have a rubber band here, which is used to unlock the main mechanism in the key puzzle box. The final rubber band in this puzzle box is actually assisting this spring. And the way it works is it's looped through the bottom. The, the rubber band goes through here and back around the T6222 to always assist that spring so it always and forever stays springy, unlike the one in the original, which will eventually wear out, especially if you leave it compressed overnight. And the face is a separate piece which is meant to fit directly into the final mega assembly. All the feedback, all the considerations, every single component of this puzzle box has been redesigned. While you're printing the remix, go take a look at the original launch of the key puzzle box. That video is pretty funny. And uh, take a closer look at the assembly video. And if you need to, there is a solve video that I created for this puzzle box as well. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video.